advantage. You want me to rant about shotguns? I will rant about shotguns. And I will do it peacefully, quietly, and with all due respect. No offense to Treyarch, nothing mean to Vondahar, and I will be as polite and quiet as possible. Now, I just said everything I will not be, so let's get that out of the way. And this is a, a one or two month old gameplay. Oh, the fuck. It's an SMR double nuke, finally we got it. Well, we had one before by BK, but that was for something else we didn't even include in that series. And I uploaded it before I was checking, I was like, can I upload that again? Like, did... Cause I put that on another channel, and I'm like, can I upload it? But nah, can I upload it? Cause it was already on. I already uploaded it before. It was a terrible commentary, terrible video. It was terrible. Literally, I screwed up my rendering settings or whatever, so it looks worse than normal, which is phenomenal. Because this is an SMR double nuke, and uh, what I introduced in the beginning there was, is I asked a question on my last commentary. Only got one reply. One is good enough, but. A few people have a commentary, you know, something for me to rant or even talk about, for me to talk respectively. Of course, when I talk respectively, I have to yell at least one part in the commentary. So, you know, leave it down in the comments below, and I will. I look at all of them, and I will go through all of them. So, just give me something to talk about. It helps when I eventually think of, I might be doing the two videos a day. A lot of people were like, yay! The first comment I saw is like, twice a day. I'm like, what is that? Because I didn't... I, I, I forget the commentaries as soon as I do them, but then I eventually go back and listen to my own voice. Which, painful as it may, it, it is funny if you hear it through someone else's vi vo mic! Because, you know, it doesn't sound like you. So what do we got today? As I said, this is an SMR double nuke and slums. Yeah, I know we have slums every day, but what is that? Okay. That's a little questionable. But that's, that's beyond this. I don't trust people anymore. This is by Rumsky. I don't know his... Uh, yep, yeah, Rumsky! Hi, Rumsky! And what, what else is there? So I'm, I'm trying to think of something I can productively do before ranting about shotguns. And I'm... I'm let's talk about shotguns, okay? Oh, also on the side note of uh, the... Uh, what's it called? Okay. See, that guy was... Try whatever. Uh, what, what did I do yesterday? Yeah, the uh, AN94 in the patch notes. In the patch notes! It said damage reduced, but in actuality, the range has just been reduced. Supposedly, the difference is so unnoticeable, you won't notice it. I guess that comes with it being unnoticeable, but whatever. It's a little bit more relieving to know that it's not as bad as I expected it to be, or patched, you know, Vano. I already, I already raged about it yesterday, so I don't need to do it again. What was I going to talk about? Shotguns. I don't know where to go with this, since I've done at least ten other commentaries about it. I should do, you know, go from the top, go from the bottom, I don't know. I'm just going to express my feelings. I'm going to go from COD 1 to, to, not COD 1, World at War. That's the first game I can remember shotguns because COD 4, the shotguns weren't that good. World at War shotguns, they weren't that overpowered. I mean, you had the trench gun and you had the double barrel. The double barrel could be attachment to a sawed-off. Both of them, they could one hit, but it was very improbable. Like, it's, it's getting a headshot with the SMR. That's the probability. You get a one hit, but it's not too common. So you usually had to hit two hits. Which is fine with me, you know? That's good. That's how shotguns should be in this game. Not one hit. Two hit. Or if they're one hit, they should have broken range. So they were fine in World at War. And then you went to MW2. And, like, what? What happened? You go from nothing to, like, like, shotgun Jesus. That's just what happened. You had Rangers Akimbo, Models Akimbo. That's the KSG. It's a it's a hip fireable KSG. It had more range than the KSG. Fatally too. Yeah, whatever. Rangers. The striker was in that. The striker wasn't as good, but it was still the BS. AA12. I called it the vibrator. What else was there? Spaz12. Uh. I don't know. I don't know all the shotguns in that game, but <sighs> that whatever. You know. Let's see. And there were secondaries, too, so everyone had a fucking shotgun. All the snipers, look at my shotgun, I'm so good. Why? What? That, he died. Why? That's all I can say to this. Why? Why the fuck do you need to put shotguns in the game that you can shoot all the way across the map? This is... I was going to say Halo, but I was about to... I, was, I had to relapse that because Halo, the shotgun is pretty, pretty balanced. You can outpower it pretty well, and it doesn't have much range. But whatever. 
you, you had the fucking models. It took three to three to four months for them to get patched. Don't get all technical. It only took two weeks. Don't. No, I don't care. It took three months in my world to get patched. I used them. I loved them. But against me, they're terrible. I don't even know how people could drop a 1KD in that game. That MW2, that game had infinite levels of bullshit. It's unbelievable. That mixed with the javelin glitch, people running around like little fucking fairies. Ha <laughs> ha Kill yourselves. And the Rangers Kimbo, after the model patch, became the Antichrist. I hated them. One bullet from that gun was all it took to kill you. But there was four. If there were Kimbo. Four. You... Had a 0% chance. Unless that guy was playing with his eyelids or elbows. He's not missing. Especially since it's a... Why is he not killing him? Whatever. What is that logic? No, I'm gonna... Yeah. Whatever. It's terrible. Why they put... Thank God there hasn't been a shotgun as scary as the models or the rangers. Of course, you may say something else, but I disagree with it. Oh, you know, I'm not disagreeing with it. I'll get there. See, Black Ops 1, let's see, what they have? Stakeout, that sucked. Spaz, spaz, spas, whatever it was. No. Bitches would run with that thing suppressed and ghost. And they'd always find a way behind me, because the maps in that game were fucking cryptic. I didn't know where I was going. I only played it for two days, so I didn't know much about the game. But ghost in the shotgun suppressed. It's terrible. Bitches would be riding your fucking ass around the corner and shit. Like, come on! Why? Why? What? I thought Treyarch was better than that. It's not too bad. It makes MW2 look like the pinnacle of perfection. But it was still enough to irritate me. You know, I mean, it was a two-shot shotgun for the most part. I mean, unless the guy is grabbing you by the balls and shooting. It won't be exactly killing you. But it's still, it was semi-auto for whatever reason. A pump-action shotgun, it, it pumps itself. That's all it does. Let's see. MW3. Oh my god. Infinity Ward. They are infamous. Infamous Ward. For putting these shotguns in the game. Now, I can't wait to see Total Call of Duty Ghost. I can't wait to see the BS coming to that. I mean, MW2. MW3. Striker. The Antichrist Striker. The fully improved Model 1887 implemented. Let's see. What else was in that game? You had the KSG-12, which was terrible before patched. That's how a shotgun should be. Like that, if you ever used it, I don't remember how it was, but I know it was bad. The USAS-12, that thing was a beast, first shotgun you get, tore it up, it was probably considered the best one, overall performance. Model, the model was terrible in that game, I don't know any other shotguns. Uh, let's see, AA-12, that, that, oh, that thing was terrible. I mean, 1v1, it would usually win, but it took 8, eight bullets to kill someone, which, even in my book, that's, that's far overpowered, but it, 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 it was not great, okay? <sighs> Let's get to what game is that called? Uh, Black Ops 2. This game, this flaw, this anti Nobel Peace Prize, this. I don't know what that means. This, It's the anti of anything productive. This game is far from perfect, and if perfect were far from itself, then I'm sure it would be. Wow! So. The shotguns in this game, I'm extending the common gameplay or whatever to fit the commentary. They're terrible. Come on. I mean, they're not terrible, terrible. They're overpowered, terrible. You have the Remington, which is your basic, you know, powerhouse. And you have the KSG. And you have the S12. You have the M12. The, M the M12 isn't that good. But the S12, you know, I'm going to talk about this some at a later date. The commentary is coming too close. If you enjoyed it, leave a like.